Hey guys, Rich Page, R. Jemathan, Timber Frame Company, the main timber framer. I've been doing a bunch of work on some rafters, cutting a, a rafter seat cut. And it's, it's long, it's, you know, they might be 15, 16 inches long on the seat cut. I like to make a straight cut, so what I like to use is a, is a saw offset. Uh, and let me show you how to make an offset so it comes out perfect every time. So I've already made this one, but I'm going to walk through what to do. So take a, take a piece of wood that you want to be your offset. Take one side and run this side here through your table saw. So you've got a nice straight, straight edge. Take another piece. It's got to stand proud of your offset to be piece so that your, your table fence on your saw will run against it. Connect this up with some screws. And, then, and now what you have is a piece of wood. And what you'll end up doing is taking your saw running it on this fence, and it will end up cutting this line against this fence. This fence, of course, is against your table saw cut, so we know that's straight. Now when you follow this fence with your saw, it's making a perfect line on this side of where your blade is. So if you need to make an offset, this is the easiest way to make the offset perfect every time. So again, take your piece, Run it through your table saw on one side so you got a straight edge. Your offset obviously has to be bigger than your measure. You know, you're going to flip your saw over. Measure from here to here to your blade. Make it a little bit longer. Maybe leave yourself an inch or two. Put a fence on your piece. Put a fence on the, the uh, table saw edge. And then all you need to do is run your saw down this piece, creating this line. And this now is an offset, and it's perfectly sized to your blade with your, with your uh, table saw fence against this fence, and it comes out to the right size. Give me some feedback. Click like and subscribe. Hope this helps. Thanks, guys.